how are you? I want to show you my book. I wrote this book. The name of the book is Strategic Experiential Family Therapy. That's the type of work that we do in my office, myself and my interns. We specialize in bicultural relationships and everything that is about relationships. Um, but I'm going to give you another clue about sex. I'm going to do like little tips, little two minute video about sex. Do you know that you can punish through sex? Do you know who has more power in a relationship? The one that wants more sex or the one that wants less sex? Let me tell you, the answer of that question is the one that wants less sex. And you know why? Because they control the, the frequency of sex. Second question, if you have a small penis, it, it means that you're not going to be able to have good sex? Wrong. Sex is not about the size of the penis. It's about the ability to connect and to perceive the needs and the taste of the other person that you have in front. Sexual desire increased or decreased with avoiding conflict. People that avoid conflict are the one that has less sexual desire. A lot of the, the couples that I work with and relationships of people that fight a lot, sometimes they have good sex. Some of them, they have great relationships. There's the safety relationship, no fights, no discussions. I think they cover everything up. And so they're avoiding conflict people. They are the one that has the least amount of sexual desire. And I'm done with this. This is little clues about sex.